Hey guys, rock and roll, we're back with another episode of Dead by Daylight Killing. This time we are playing as the cannibal. Like I say, trying to play them all on the channel, so this will be the fourth killer I play. Yeah, because I've played Billy a few times, Doctor, Huntress, and now the cannibal. So, let's have to see how this goes. As last video proved, I'm a lot better with the hillbilly than I am with the Huntress. Although that's down to my hatchet throwing being, well, subpar to say the least. Come on. Ready up, Meg. And detective tap. Thank you. Now, this could be interesting. I haven't played, obviously haven't played Countable before, so... Faint Regent. Okay, so two people really want to be getting generators done. And uh, we can't be letting that happen. Killers can break drop pallets. No sh Sherlock. Seriously, give me some useful, useful advice. One, things that I can use to my benefit and to the survivor's downfall. Every killer has a unique power, just some of them are a lot better than others. For example, the nurse. Like, literally, nurse is the best killer in the game, which is, once you get good. And she's probably the reason why you can't... I mean, it's an asymmetric game, so it's very hard to balance it anyway, but when you've got a character that negates, like, the pallets, which is what the nurse basically does, kind of makes it even harder to balance it. So, I do not envy the developers who have to deal with the killers complaining about the survivors being OP and the survivors complaining about the killers being OP. As someone on the fence, who's more of a survivor main, I honestly don't think there's that much in it. Um, you know, maybe, maybe there's a little too much power in pallet looping still, but that's the only thing I'd probably complain about. And I'm playing this just after the Huntress game, so I still have loads of glare on my telly because I didn't decide to uh, close my curtains. So, yeah, yay me. Now I'm doing... Wow. Hill... Um, cannibal is fast. Like, um, Huntress is so slow. In comparison... I am zooming through this place. Okay, so that's the way we're going. Let's see if we can uh, get someone down. Ah, oh, damn it. You know what? I swung through. I got the hit. I'm not too too upset about that. Oh. Damn it, Meg got away. Damn it. I wanted to pull her out then. I love how he just shakes the blood off his off his hammer. Stop wiggling. Let's get you on a hook. There we go, Meg. Enjoy. Now we'll go this way. See, I'm a good, I'm a nice killer. I don't camp. Give this a little kick. Okay, you're nearby. Okay, 
Okay, follow the scratch marks. What? There we go, got ya. Can I please stop chainsawing? Okay, get you on the hook. There we go. Let's go back this way. Okay, I don't know if I like the chainsaw on um, the cannibal, but it's interesting. There were scratch marks around here. Okay, so I was certain that there was somebody pulling off the hook then. Guess not. Okay, let's just go through this way. Okay, so he went... Shoot. Shake that blood off. Don't just randomly throw pallets down. Damn. Got ya. I know there was a Claudette here as well, but... There we go. That gets us a hit on the Claudette. Okay, that was easy. Sorry, I went I went really quiet for a second then. I was just like really focusing on trying to kill these guys. Where's Detective Tap gone then? Nice try. Really? This dude's just given up. Alright, let's see if we can find anyone else. You see, I'm too nice, aren't I? Let's see if we can find any any survivors. I say I'm too nice. I go miles away just so that they can have a fair shot. Well, there's somebody.
Stop chainsawing. He just tried to pallet stun me. Oh, that was cool. That's death. Didn't know that. You made it easy for me here, David. What? How did that not hit him? You're going in the basement for that. Actually, the basement isn't here. I don't know. We'll just stick on this hook. Unfortunately, I have two... Two gens done, so... Oh, he's all the way over there. Okay, thank you, barbecue and chili. Come on, give me more four, man. I know he was over this way. I know that I'm going to watch this back and I'm going to have seen him at some point. I just walked straight past him. I can't believe there's one little corner of this map that I haven't looked in. But there's the hat. Oh my god. I, I just want him to jump down there now. I honestly just want him to get the hatch. Because this is just ridiculous at this point. And now I've gone completely away from the hatch so I don't know where that is. Actually, I might just message him and just say where it is. Alright. Send message. Hatch. Corner. Come get. There you go. I still get a ruthless killer for that, so I don't care. <laughs> I still get a lot of points for that. You don't get much deviousness, though. I'm happy with that. Still plenty of points, and I pipped, so... I'd say everyone wins, really. Plus, you got some extra points, so... I'd say call that GG. And that video went on way longer. I might just cut a load of it out, actually. We'll see. But anyway, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button and subscribe for more Dead by Daylight matches.